good morning. It is Friday, March 23rd, and I'm on my way to the airport. I am going to Boca for the weekend to shoot with Beast and Bodybuilding.com. So, should be a fun, exciting weekend, and I'm going to bring you along behind the scenes, show you everything we're doing. We have really good content, a lot of stuff to film in a couple days, so I'm really excited. It's, it's super early. I mean, it's it's 4.45. I woke up at like 3.50 because I wanted to blow dry my hair before I left since I didn't bring all my hair products. I only have a carry-on, so I can't bring all my stuff with me. I swear, my hair is this short, but I use about like 20 different products for it. So I tried to blow dry it, put a little blowout to it, some volume. Since I'm not sure how much time I'll have to get prepped before, we're gonna shoot the moment we land. We have a gym scene first, then we actually have a kitchen scene, which is really cool. We're gonna get some groceries, kind of shoot a, a what I eat in the day type video. Yeah feel really weird because I did not bring my food with me. I only have a carry-on and I did not have any room for all my food. I even had it prepped in the freezer ready to go, but I'm like, I don't have room. So I'm just going to wing it, get something for breakfast, lunch, dinner. So I eat out healthy anyways, so it doesn't, it doesn't really matter, but so yeah, whenever I travel, I normally prep all my food with me just because, one, it's so much easier. You have all your stuff with you, and I don't know. It just makes me feel better when I have everything prepared. I'm a planner. <laughs> I'm definitely a planner, but what I do is the night before, I get everything ready, and I only bring like one or two pieces of Tupperware, and then I put everything else in bags. I know, if it's old prep lifestyle, but I put everything in bags, and I actually freeze it that way, by the time I land wherever I'm going, it's unthawed and it doesn't ruin the food. So tip for people traveling, especially in prep, that's what I had to do all the time. Freeze your food the night before. It's probably, it's, we rock hard in the morning, but when you put it in your suitcase, by the time you land somewhere, it's going to be thawed out and it's not going to, you know, it's going to hold, it's not going to go bad on you. This morning I'm like, you know what? I don't have room for this, so I'm not going to stress about it. I'm just not going to bring it. I'm on my way to the airport. I will check in with you then. We'll see you later.
6.25 p.m. Did a gym type workout with talk throughs of like each exercise that we did. We did an at home workout and then we did like a meal prep through the grocery store. We actually tried to go through Publix and got kicked out. <laughs> pretty good footage today. I'm actually pretty drained. I took like a 10 minute cat nap. Why do people call it a cat nap? I don't know. Anyways, I took like a quick little nap and now I might go downstairs and do some cardio because I didn't really get a workout in today, but Apple Watch is dead. Let me charge it. But anyways, it is like 6.30 now. So we have to wake up super early at like 6.15 tomorrow to get to the beach and do our last kind of scene of the beach workout. So I'm really excited for that one. That one's going to be awesome. This lighting's not good. So my eyes, I'm so tired, but it is now 8 p.m. and I'm hungry, so... We're gonna go get something quick to eat and then I'm gonna come back and pass out because I am exhausted, so. Good morning. So second day, we're gonna head to the beach. We're gonna do a sunrise shoot. So I'm super excited. Bring you along and I love this lighting. I think I might buy a lighting like this in our bathroom at home, but it's so good. So see you then. Day two of filming. We are going to the beach today to get some cool shots. on the ceiling. What is up? Sorry, I have a mint in my mouth. But I am back from Boca. I landed super late last night, like 1, 2 p.m. So I have some stuff to do this morning. I'm going to do homework later today. I had a, I normally, I told you guys in my last video, I normally get a blonde flat white from Starbucks, but I got the blonde cappuccino 
and it was really good. I'm actually about to see what the calories are on this. But it was lower calories than the blonde flat, which I used to be like when I'm in prep or trying to like diet down, I'm like really concerned on my calories. But when it comes to like coffee and stuff like that, I can, I can spare a few calories. It's worth it. So you can't even really see me, but I'm at Petco right now. I'm sorry, PetSmart. PetSmart to get some dog food and I'm about to go get these puppies filled in. And I was just thinking, I'm like, what am I gonna have for dinner? Because I don't really have much prepped. I went to the grocery store to get a couple of things, but I mean, it's not like I have any food like ready for dinner, but I said, I'm gonna eat enlightened ice cream tonight. So I'm excited for that. All right, everyone, that's probably going to conclude this vlog. It is now Monday, March 26th, and I'm about to go do my glute slash leg day because Mondays are always for the glutes. Yeah. And I don't know if everyone, whoever has like AirPods, but I buy these cases off Amazon. They're so helpful because it like protects this plastic piece. Um, I'm like showing you like you can see it, but it protects this part, a silicone case, and I love it because if I throw it, I know I'm not gonna damage it and get scratches, but yeah. Well, I'm off to the gym. Sorry if this vlog was like all over the place, but you know what? My life is all over the place, so there you go. Like and subscribe below. Comment below what video you would like to see next. I can do a full day of eating. I really want to do a physique update since I did a bod pod recently. And yeah, so just comment below.